I bought a lot of stuff lately. Alright, today uh, is my first unboxing video, but uh, I'm kind of excited because uh, I've had packages that uh, it's been stacking up for a month, and uh, yeah, I thought why not uh, open up uh, everything at once, you know what I mean? So, why don't we get started? So these are uh, LED lights uh, for my camera and they can be uh, mounted on a tripod and I actually have one right here. This is my, my camera that I got and it has, you see this little, right now I'm shooting on my uh, phone just because I haven't uh, set this bad boy up yet but I'll be excited to get this set up. You see I can take the, the light and then uh, put it over here on top, take the camera out, and uh, that was open up real fast so I can, I can show you what it looks like. So, Alright, so there's just some instructions, and uh, this is probably like the mount, and this is the cable. Uh, USB cable, USB C, and uh, here's the light itself. And I bought two of them. This is because uh, when I start to make more videos, uh, they'll come in really handy. So this is uh, what you do, you just, uh, no, this isn't, yeah, this one. This screws on like that. And, uh, Actually, do it real quick so you can see what it looks like. And uh, let's, uh, there you go. It seems to be uh, set up. And then uh, you can just control, you can tilt it, depending, and angle it depending on where you want the light. Uh, with this application, I'm probably going to be shooting at my computer. So I'm going to have it like in front of my monitor, uh, then I'm going to probably have the camera over here somewhere. And I gonna, since this is fairly low, uh, I think you want to angle it kind of just straight really. If it was high, then you probably want to angle it downward. Uh, and then if it was lower, you want to angle it uh, this way, you know, to, to the sky. Uh, this is actually the reason why I bought it. It's very flexible because you can even use it uh, as key lights in the back. You know what I mean? They could even be off camera, but you can have these like pointed up against the wall. You know what I mean? Just to add more dimension uh, to the background. Like right now, I have a little lamp right there that I'm just using. But uh, this, this is going to be a lot better. But uh, yeah, so I just want to, to show you that one. And I'll put it away from now, but... Bear with me for a second. And this is pretty cool. I, I, uh, this little, little mounty thing, uh, you can actually use it for a multitude of applications. One is uh, you can use it as a little selfie stick uh, when you don't have it on your uh, tabletop, you know what I mean? Tabletop uh, tripod. But, you know, let's say you're, you're going out, you want to do a vlog, and you can just simply, you know, take a camera with you, and uh, this helps provide uh, more stab stabilization for your, your uh, vlogging. And then you, you got a screen, you can see yourself, and you film yourself at the same time. So, that's, that's pretty cool. Alright, this is, uh, I gotta be very strategic because I uh, don't have a lot of room. But, uh, yeah, this is kind of fun. It's my first unboxing video, so it's good practice for sure. Anyway, uh, let's start with the next uh, package. I think I know what this is. This is some more 
uh, video stuff. And uh, it comes. He came in a huge box. So when I show you what it is, uh, you'll be. <laughs> you'll start laughing. Anyway, uh, this is what came in it. I mean, I don't know why they didn't pack it in an envelope. But, let's see if you can uh, I'll show you. These are actually uh, diffusion filters. They're gels. So, uh, what they do is, uh, these came like uh, 12 sheets. And uh, the light that I showed you earlier, uh, you put this on top of it, and it provides uh, some diffusion for it. Uh, which is it's very useful because uh, those kind of lights can be really harsh. I have a, a light right now that I'm using. It's actually a ring light. And, um, you know, sometimes uh, the shadows that it casts on your face can be, you know, can pr provide like an unpleasant image uh, in your videos. So uh, when you use the, the filters, the diffusion filters, uh, it'll soften up that light. So this is good. Uh, most of the stuff I bought on Amazon, but uh, the last one I bought on BMH uh, Photo Video, and they have a location on uh, 34th Street. And they mostly have like uh, uh, photography, video stuff, and computers. So let's see what we got here. By the time the unboxing is over, I'm not going to be able to move anywhere, uh, so that'll be fun. But this is actually, um, I like snacks, and uh, this is just a simple popcorn maker. So what you do is, uh, it's collapsible, made by a company called Hot Pop. You can see it right here, you, know, you, you uh, pop it out, and then... Uh, this is just a lid. So you, you know, you put popcorn inside and just you know, flavor it how you like. Put it in the microwave and, you know, two minutes you got uh, instant popcorn. So, pretty cool. And uh, this is, oh, a power bank from Rap Power. And uh, take it out the package and show the words. Very cool. It's fairly portable because um, you can see it has like a slim design. But uh, let me just get closer if you can compare it to um, yes, my camera. You can see it's not that that big, so you can you can carry it with you in your pack. It could probably even fit in your pocket, but you know what I mean. Anyway, uh, the reason I got this is because it has a indicator. So when you're charging it, it'll show the percentage, and um, it has USB-C, uh, which is uh, becoming the standard now, you know what I mean? Because uh, devices are getting more powerful, and uh, USB-C provides uh, the best throughput and the best charging times. So uh, this has power delivery, uh, which means... Uh, if your device supports fast charging, uh, it'll be able to uh, charge it a lot faster. So, uh, typically, like the newer phones, can uh, go from zero to fifty uh, percent in about eighteen minutes. So, uh, yeah, this is definitely worth it. For me. Anyway, it's kind of cool. Oh, cool! They gave me a gift card too. So, if I, I want to buy another uh, Grab Power product. Which I think I will be because uh, I just like the kind of products that they have. So kind of... All right, let's get started with the next one. Oh, uh, I'm not sure what this is. Let's check it out. What is this? Oh, uh, okay. So this is a essential oil set. Just you know for good smells. But let me bring it up closer. I just thought I got a really good deal on it. But you can see, like, it has all these different uh, flavors or 
uh, 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 well, these are for aromatherapy, but you can use it for topical treatments too, like for massage oil. But uh, yeah, I just thought it was cool because uh, recently I bought a uh, a diffuser, and I'm sorry I can't bring it out any further because it's plugged in. But uh, you know, you you uh, fill this up with water, and then you put some of these oil, like a couple of drops of the oils in. Then the mist comes out the top and uh, makes your room smell good. So if you're having guests over, uh, you know, you just don't want a musty smell when they, they come in. You want it to smell nice. So yeah, that's why I got that. But uh, yeah, so that's this one. I, the freaking package was all, all messed up. So let's hope that the innards are. When I checked what it was, I don't think it's anything fragile, so, but I mean, still, you can't, you know, just throw packages around, like, so a few things came in here, two, and three. Let's do the small one stuff, and then we can get the bigger. So this is another product that I bought from my power. This is, uh, you know, the first thing I got was the US uh, power adapter uh, that supports USB-C. So you can, you know, charge your devices on the go. You can even uh, charge a laptop. It's a 18,000 uh, milliamp hour battery. So, with the indicator, which is really good. This is just uh, the ball charger, but it's uh, USB-C uh, power delivery. So it, it's basically, you know, the other one was a portable version. This is uh, to, you know, charge at home you know, your laptop or your phone a lot faster. This supports the power delivery. And it has the regular USB too. So this is, but yeah, there wasn't too much to say about that. Um, this is a good price uh, too. So, yeah. This is, uh, oh, okay. These are just for my room. Let's see. But uh, what they are is uh, square uh, 3M stickies. That's all it is. But uh, I needed these because um, I have to mount some lighting on the wall. And uh, these are just going to make it a lot easier for me to do. Um, and, and off camera behind me, um, my TV is mounted to the wall, and I have a uh, light strip uh, that I want to put behind it so you can sort of uh, have like a nice visual effect behind the TV. But uh, I need uh, to use these to be able to mount it. So that was that. This, uh, I'm not going to take out the package, it's just uh, some wall shelving. And I, got, I actually bought two, two sets of these. I guess maybe I could take it out. Yeah, why not? This is the unboxing video. If I didn't unbox it then, you know, what am I just showing you the box? So I'll unbox it real quick. And it's not even a really nice box. I mean, at least these, if I was like, you know, this is what it was, uh, then you have a, a good idea because of the packaging. But this, you can't, you can't tell. So let me show you. So this right here, uh, there's just some some nice shelving. Uh, there's three three shelves, two two larger ones, and this one is a smaller one. It comes up to about you know here, and the other ones come up here. But uh, they're very low profile, so you know I'm kind of uh, limited on space. So even my shelving, uh, you know, can't be full size. So this actually fits will fit perfect on the wall. That's over there, you can't really see it, but so you know, I want to build like a nice little productivity wall uh, where I can, you know, work on my laptop and also uh, just showcase art and you know, maybe some of these figures even. But uh, that's that's pretty much that. Get that over there. Right. Let's get the next one. Uh, where is it? It was from Amazon. That's the 
can tell. It's a logo. Whoa. Okay. Alright. So, uh, these. And these are actually just really cool stickers that I got off food. And uh, you'll see why in a second. I'm not gonna spoil it, but you can see sort of, uh, see there's like an ice cream, and I like the art style, you know, they're very like pop arty, look at this, this is like a Chinese food sticker, and uh, here's like a nice Coke and a hamburger, and here's like a big hamburger, that's like a dagger kind of hamburger, I don't know if you remember, but I'll show you uh, why I got these uh, a little bit, a little bit. So, uh, yeah. After this, I'm not even sure. Let's, let's open it and find out. This is kind of fun. I'm glad I kind of saved everything because usually I just, you know, open it up as soon as we get to it. But, uh, oh wow, okay. This is great. This is, uh, the stream deck. And this is, uh, for my computer. But uh, it's basically a controllable uh, keypad, and uh, you can actually use it uh, to automate uh, certain things on your computer. For example, uh, you can uh, you can launch uh, files by pressing a button. You can launch folders, and you can launch websites. So, like, let's say you can even order food with it. Uh, there's a service called. IFTT, T, it stands for if this then that, which is basically um, two kind of separate actions. It basically, if this stands for this, then this happens. So basically, you can make a button press, which will be the this, and the that will be uh, launch Domino's website and order food. So you can actually program it uh, to press a button and order your pizza, <laughs> which is fairly novel but it's a, it's pretty cool but the reason that I want to use it is because uh, you know I have a lot of smart lighting and uh, when I start making videos uh, I'm going to need access to those on the fly because you know opening up my phone uh, just takes too long and I, I can't I can't open up my phone uh, in the middle of a video so uh, you know once I I can actually control my lighting just by pressing a button you know, I can I'll be able to change scenes uh, you know, turn on and off and stuff like that. So this is what I got. It was a little bit pricey, but I think uh, it's worth it for what it does. And uh, I'll open it up really quickly and show you. Plastic is my game. They just make it so hard for you to get into. I don't want to, because I like the packaging, I don't want to you know, ruin it. There you go. And uh, the company uh, that makes this is called Elgato, but they make a lot of sh uh, streaming products for streaming and, and webcasting. But uh, the reason that I like this is that this product has good presentation. Let's see how this is supposed to, to work. It's very neat to see this. Product. Okay, so you just put the. There we go. So this is how it sits. It basically sits on your desk, and these buttons are actually uh, LED uh, and can display images. So I thought it looks pretty cool, and it's very functional. So yeah, that's the Stream Deck by Elgato. Let's start with the next package. Uh, also from At this point, I've opened so many boxes, I can get into it immediately. I don't really want to do that off camera. This, I've been waiting for a while, and I'm excited. Find out what it is. You're like, why is he so excited about this? But, uh, it's a company called Iron Flask. <laughs> they basically just make water bottles. Simple as that. Um, you know what I mean, but uh, I don't know, for some reason, uh, I just like the way that the website looked, 
and I like their product video. And even though it's a water bottle, you know, they somehow made it look like I wanted to buy it. So I did, and they had all these little extras that I can uh, show you in a minute. And uh, this one, I think, was the 18 ounce uh, model. They had like a few different sizes. And another thing was that it comes standard uh, with a few tops. So this is what it looks like. It looks very creamy. I got white, but they have all different colors. And it has the logo on it. Uh, but you can see this one. This is kind of cool. So the screws on, screw on top. And it, you know, when you open it, it has like a little handle that you can just carry it. Drink. But the, the bonus was that it comes uh, with two other uh, lids. You see what I mean? So you can just take this one off, put this one on, this one comes with some ring. And now you got like a new look. You know what I mean? To your water bottle. And here's the third top. That's screws on. Now this is sort of like the oh this is like the coffee kind of lid, you know what I mean? For like hot beverages, just to keep everything warm and you know, So that's cool. And I got uh, actually some extras. And uh, check this out. It's <laughs> This is just a little boot for the bottle that you put on the bottom so it doesn't get scratched up, which is kind of cool. But uh, yeah, this is a company that makes really interesting water bottles, to be honest. They have every color, a bunch of different styles, all these changeable lids. And this is going to add, uh, this thing I got right here is going to add a little bit of functionality to the, the product. Check this out. This, uh, this is actually my favorite list. I'm going to use this one. Yeah, you put the one like that. Screw the top on. That's what you said. But uh, you screw the top on. Make sure it's tight and secure. And uh, this one fuck this. There you go. And it's a power cord handle. So, uh, you, can carry it, you can just carry it like that, you know, when you're walking around. It also has a carabiner that you can use uh, to, to hook it up to uh, your book bag when you're, you, know, you don't want to carry it. And, of course, the, the boot is removable. So, yeah, I got like this water bottle and all these little accessories. I was a real, I was a, I'm a fan of it. I like it. Yeah, let's put that away. Yeah. Alright, we, we got through a few of them. Uh, we're going to keep going. This is something to look at real quick because um, it's not too interesting. But it's necessary. This is just a something I got from the store down the street, actually. I didn't get it in the mail. But I need it for, for storage. And uh, I'm running out of space. But I got a. Uh, this cutting, it's like a cutting board. And um, you know, I'm just using this to restore some stuff. Basically, that's all. Alright, here is uh, another package. For this, I actually bought some more water bottles. Three of them. And uh, I'll show that to you. So, uh, let me open one of them. I actually bought three of them. They're not all mine. Uh, I bought one for my nephew and uh, one for my niece and then uh, one for me. So let me take out. Look at that. On the first try. I got mine. Uh, I got the all white. Just because I, I just like that colorway. And this is a little bit bigger than the other one. This is a, a 32 ounce. So I could put a little bit more water in there. 
But, you know, they come with two straws, lots of straws, and a straw cleaner. So I'm probably, probably not going to use those. But, uh, this one, I, I like the, this candle. This is a, the good thing about it is, um, even though uh, the, the other one, the Hydro Flask, was smaller, you can actually use the, those lids on here and vice versa. So now I have almost, yeah, I have four lids, different lids. This one is a straw lid. So uh, you just put it down and then bring it up to drink. This one has a built-in, um, you know, carry case. You just, you, you can put on your backpack. And uh, it's a very good quality. You know, it's a very premium uh, water bottle. I just, you know, can appreciate stuff like this. Because it's very functional and stylish. But remember before, I also got these, some more stickers. So now I told you I was going to, what I was going to use these for. Basically to, you know, decorate the, the water bottle. And uh, I just bought a whole bunch of stickers for that. These are sort of, let me, let me see if I can show you these ones. Well, I'll leave it in the thing. Because I kind of got these more for my niece and my nephew. But, you know, they're just a bunch of little, like, have, like, some sayings on them. Kind of like, like a little bit meme you know? Just, uh, like, big into memes because of the internet. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much uh, that. It's right here. Yeah, let's keep it moving. What the hell is this? This is cooking. Uh, it's a spring form pan. Uh, basically, you use it to make pie. So, uh, you make. Oh, there you go. There's the. You make the pie, put the pie in there. You can unlatch it, take it off, and now you have a perfect uh, circular pie. So, that's that. This is a wall mount um, from a monitor. Ready mount on my TV, but also uh, have a PC, and I just want a cleaner look, so this is why I got this. And uh, it was fairly inexpensive. This is uh, some more cooking stuff. It's just actually stainless steel uh, bowls. The whole set comes with lids too. So this is the smallest one, and. Uh, you know, they just get bigger. So there's like six of them. But you, you know, you get that. These are just bowls for, for cooking. And they all have lids. As you know, I like to cook, so I gotta have those supplies. Uh, what's this? Oh, okay. So this is a very unassuming little package, but uh, it's very powerful. Uh, in reality, uh, in terms of functionality, so here it is, uh, and uh, it's a video uh, capture card, which is severely underpriced. Uh, so this is like a generic uh, brand, uh, and uh, Elgato makes the same version, but they charge uh, ten times more. And when I start to do research. Functionality uh, is, is, is the same, pretty much, uh, which was what everybody was saying. And what the, what this does is allows me uh, to turn this, my uh, DSLR camera, into a webcam. Basically, just by plugging this into my computer using a USB port and uh, using an HDMI 
uh, cable to mini HDMI, and your computer is going to recognize uh, your DSLR as a webcam. And that has a multitude, <laughs> multitude of uses. You can actually live stream with uh, you know higher quality because now the image is coming from the picture is coming from your DSLR camera. But you can also record straight uh, to your computer, and uh, that I want to do uh, for a few reasons because um, this camera is pretty good, uh, has really good video quality. Uh, it doesn't, it's not a 4K camera. But uh, I can record uh, ABC uh, HD uh, 60 frames, and uh, so that that's a pretty good image. The thing is, it doesn't have um, an audio input, so you can't um, connect any external uh, mics to it or anything like that, which is a big bummer, you know, because it has everything else. It has good video quality. Uh, it has the flip-up screen, so you can use it for vlogging. And it has really good uh, autofocus and image stabilization, which is uh, a really like high-end feature. Uh, and for the price that I got this camera for, was a steal. You know, I paid under uh, three hundred dollars uh, with the lens. And uh, but uh, yeah, so now when you uh, use this autofocus video capture card uh, to your computer. Um, you can now uh, hook up mics to your computer so you can have that higher quality audio. But that was that. Very useful. And I think that, that thing was, that capture card was maybe under $30. So uh, worth it. This is a, um, a adapter. Basically, you can use it to mount certain devices. Um, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to use it for, but uh, I know it's going to come in handy. So, I, you know, it's just a couple of bucks, and I know I'm going to use this for something. Um, so, yeah. That is the longest unboxing video ever. But I did have a lot of packages. So, this, uh, let's see what this is. I think I know what this is. I've been waiting for this for couple of weeks got this from from China which is good considering how far uh, it's coming from so we'll just change this real quickly out of the package and uh, tell you what it is these wow I didn't, they're a lot smaller than I thought they were these are actually uh, dummy batteries, if that's what they call them. Dummy batteries for uh, my DSLR camera. So, uh, a typical occurrence when you're making videos on your DSLR, um, they tend to actually heat up after uh, you make a video for a while. So you can be shooting, uh, especially if you're shooting uh, for a long time, uh, you know the battery just gets really hot and uh, it can cause your device to overheat and even break so um, if you're actually using this uh, to make videos on your computer like I was explaining before like as a webcam maybe you're doing live streams too uh, you're gonna need this and what this does is uh, allows you to remove the battery and uh, you know you can uh, basically uh, use this instead that's why they call it dummy battery so you'll be able to power the device without having your battery inside uh, so that you can you know, film as long as you want uh, without worrying about overheating issues but I bought two of them because they were fairly inexpensive and uh, fairly useful so that was that now we're piling up the box to see I didn't even realize this is even here. I need a camera. What's this? Oh, wow. This is more of streaming equipment. But I got to show you this. It's just a user guide. But what it is, is uh, my microphone for my computer. And it's it's a legit one. See, it has the, the arm 
and uh, the little filter there so that you can you know talk behind the filter so that your audio can sound cleaner and that's the mic but it's from a company called Fifine <laughs> and they have a little funny name but uh, when you check their reviews uh, they're just impeccable people like this product so here's the little wind filter for the mic that you put on here's the horn that you can uh, affix to the gas I'll say I figure it out but uh, here is uh, the mic itself which is pretty cool and uh, here's the cradle that you just put it inside so it sits uh, comfortably and if you don't want to use the the whole uh, arm I do because I kind of like it you can it actually also came with a little uh, mount for your, for the microphone that you can place on on the table have it sit like that and take up a lot less room. But yeah, I'll try both and uh, see which one I like better. But it's kind of cool. You know what I mean? You just have it sitting on your, on your desk. And you can even loosen it uh, depending on what angle you want. Which is pretty cool. But uh, this, um, something like this, I thought was going to be a lot more expensive um, and it was only uh, under under eighty dollars and it got uh, very good re reviews like I always said uh, this I also been waiting quite a while this is a uh, very expensive package this is the most expensive package uh, out of everything else uh, it's by a company called uh, Lifesmart, as you can see. But uh, there's a lot of tape on this box, so this I am super excited about. So you're noticing like a common theme about everything I've opened so far. It's either been cooking or uh, basically an investment on making higher quality videos. But yeah, those are my interests right now. So, just things that I buy reflective. I'm just, you know, big into functionality and style. So I want, want to have both. I actually bought, uh, you know, these right here. These are more novel, but something, you know, that I enjoy too. So I'll, I'll show you those real fast. This. Whoa. Whoa, buddy. This is no joke. Holy cow. So, I'll tell you what they are in a minute. Let me just take them uh, out the package because, geez Louise, this is a lot. And, like I said, this is why I told you it was a very expensive. Uh, product, but I have to get them. <laughs> this is a lot. Of pain. Okay, <laughs> I think that's enough. That's everything. All right. This is a company uh, called LifeSmart, and they make uh, a product called Colo Light, and what they are are basically honeycomb shaped uh, smart lights. This is actually the stand. You can get a better picture, idea of what it looks like. And uh, they actually uh, can be, uh, you know, used with a stand. But since I, as you can clearly see, got so many, 
uh, are not going to fit on the stand. So I'm actually going to put it on the wall uh, behind my monitor. And uh, I'm really excited about that because these lights actually uh, can sync up with your with sound. So you can play music, change different colors. Uh, you know, they'll go to the beat of the music. Um, and these are also uh, smart lights. So, you know, they, they can be changed uh, a variety of ways. And uh, I bought uh, 36 of them for some reason because I wanted to cover the whole wall with them pretty much. And uh, they came uh, in packs of 18, like the biggest. I wanted to, so I, I looked at a few different sites, but the best deal I can find was a pack of 18. And the reason why they put 18 is because uh, these are actually also good because they're powered by USB. So you don't even have to plug them into the wall. You can plug them straight into your computer. They'll light up that way. But uh, doing it that way, um, the maximum amount of lights. Let me open one just so you can see like the size of it. Um, the maximum amount that you can put on one power cord uh, is 18. So you know this is how big it is. It's about three inches uh, wide and uh, three inches tall. Uh, yeah, the power everything. But since they're smart, I can connect them together to work in, con in, in conjunction with each other. So that's, that's going to be a little project. So definitely excited. I'll uh, get into the more novel stuff. Um, you know, I got all these little uh, figures from Ron English. So you have two more packages off camera, small ones. But, uh,. They're definitely on the more novel side. These I actually didn't get from, from Amazon. Not from eBay. Man. That's the thing. When you buy on eBay, these guys are not playing around with the packaging. These are super cool. Beavis and Butt has a uh, TV truck. This, uh, they don't actually sell them stores anymore, so I was excited to pick it up. Um, but, here's a use. And I have to buy it in second hand from But, it's so cool. Check it out. It's on the shelf, and, uh, yeah, Beavis and Butt has. Isn't that cool? This and by that, I picked up uh, a bunch of comics. I got 20 something issues, but I just thought these were cool and I really like the Beavis and Butthead on So I picked it up and I, I picked up all these for $15. I mean, uh, $50, under $50. So that's pretty cool. I was looking with um, some other playing cards. Please buy that playing cards. So this I also got to get second hand from the game. So, so this is Tricks Rabbit. And um, there's a good size. I like that. That's probably the smallest one. Here's a Tony the Fat Tiger. And this one's about 8 inches. A little bigger. But yeah, um, these came out in 2014. They were um, a limited run. They retail for about uh, 50 to 60 dollars, 
and have increasingly <laughs> become uh, harder to get because you know, they were limited release, limited on release. And I saw them online one day, and I was like, man, I got to get these because uh, they're very nostalgic for me since I was an '80s uh, too, uh, really big on cereal, breakfast cereal. You know what I mean? And uh, some of my favorites. Uh, was uh, Frosted Flakes and uh, Fruity Pebbles. I liked them all pretty much. So I thought to get all of these flavors. And uh, this is Toucan Sam, but uh, Ron English, uh, you know, did a little play on words. Uh, two Ton Sam. Well, two Ton Sam because uh, when you eat it, you gain weight, and that's like the overarching theme of the figures is that uh, it's basically, uh, you know, these foods aren't actually the healthiest for you, but they're fun. And uh, I'm actually only missing uh, one from my collection. They actually made more, but I didn't. I wasn't too. These are the, the ones that I like. One more that actually just got released, um, and that's the, the Honey Nut Cheerios beat. And so I want to get that. That's the only one. This is Captain Crunch. Uh, and then Captain Cornstarch is from what his name is. And well, English is universal. But that's, one of, that's probably my favorite one. And uh, I like the Lucky Charm one. Got all five of these. And I got one more. But yeah, they're about eight inches tall. So they look really cool uh, on a shelf. And these are the last two things that I got. These are officially released uh, systems uh, by their respective uh, company. So Sega actually um, released this, and uh, Sony officially released this, but they're basically mini versions of their original consoles. So uh, let me open it up so you can see uh, what it looks like. The good thing about it is, you know, they're a lot more portable. But, you know, they support the new connectivity, so these are going to be connected to your HDTV um, using HDMI. And uh, this, uh, the Sega Genesis Mini one, you know, they come with two controllers, which is so cool. This is one of my favorite controllers of all time, the original three button. It just feels really good in your hands. You know, he came out with two of them. So this is the other one. I'm not going to open it. But uh, this is the system itself, and you're going to get a kick when you look at the size of it. Because, check it out. I mean, if you remember the Sega Genesis, it was way bigger than this. And it's basically the same size as my DSLR. And you don't have to buy games. I mean, you know, this is just... Uh, all the uh, games are on the internal memory, so you don't have to, uh, you know, put any games in there, so it's pretty cool. And last but not least, this is the Sony PlayStation Mini. And I actually bought uh, two of them, because I'm giving one away uh, to my cousin if he wants it. So, yeah. I just thought they were so cool, and uh, thought you know he probably wanted one because he said he was looking for one. So let's open it up. Here you go. Oh, it's got the official logo. For some reason, people did not uh, like this console. 
Um, I guess there's some caveats or maybe the choice in titles because you can only fit so many games. But you know, there's the, the community and, and they help to uh, put better games on. 